Do you have a favorite animal? I would have to be a tiger. Are you comfortable with growling for me? <laughs> I think a real furry could do better. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Hello. What do you do? Hi. Who are you and what are you doing here today? You can call me Max. I'm completely jumping in. Whatever happens, happens. Today you're gonna be guessing who is a furry. Do you know what a furry is? No, I don't. Like hairy, furry? Furry like the people who wear costumes of characters. Oh, I don't even know what that is. I think I might know a thing or two about that. <laughs> Can you give us a real definition of what is a furry? <laughs> You're someone who really likes human-esque animals. You're like, I want to be that. And you want to build a community around that. Have you ever dressed up in a character? You know, at the Ray Festival, I'm always in a character. Have you ever had sex in an outfit or a costume? No. You have to remember, people who came from Soviet Union like me, we were really sexually deprived in a way. You'll have these. Ooh, I'd be scared to get canceled. Some say furry, some say not furry. Whew. Okay, let's bring the furries out. <laughs> I am looking for the furries. There's too many of you guys. <laughs> Hi. Hello. <laughs> What's your name? Tim. Tim, uh, mm -hmm. I'm Harvard. Nice to meet you. Um, nice to meet you. So I just found out what furries are today. Oh, you didn't know? No. Oh. <laughs> right before y'all walked in. <laughs> what is a furry to you? Probably like a non-black person. <laughs> yeah. What do you do for fun? Right now I'm playing Baldur's Gate 3, also Fortnite, things mm -hmm. like that. So Fortnite has a lot of different skins, right? Mm -hmm. Is there one in particular that you really like? Yes, one is Wendell and the other one is called Polar Patroller. Hmm, okay. Do you go out a lot? No. <laughs> no. Not really. I think she is. Why? I'm a human by my nature, myself. Mm -hmm. But like, I go to raves, that's when I dress up. So I'm assuming that sometimes you need that release. Okay. I'm gonna guess that you are a furry. Okay. Because you look a little furry. I look a little, it's the chest hair, that's what it is. Yeah. I am getting a bit of a furriness from you. Ooh, there you go. Cool, thank you. <laughs> Yay. Hello. Hey, how you doing? I'm doing all right. Um, do you like role play? <laughs> Not really. I mean, I'm more about intimacy. Oh, all right, I'm ready to guess. Already? <laughs> yes, I'm gonna guess that he is a non-furry. Okay. Sure, yeah. What do you think so? Because I, from what I'm starting to understand after two people, um, <laughs> there's a bit of a an imagination and a role play when it comes to being a furry, because you're dressing in a costume. Yeah, I guess I could say so, yeah. Do you have a favorite animal? I would have to be a tiger. Do you, are you comfortable with growling for me? <laughs> <laughs> well, because that growl was, it was good, but I think a real furry could do better. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Do you, do you have siblings? No, I'm the only child. You're a spoiled one? I am not spoiled, I actually got kicked out of the house. <laughs> no. Yeah. Like your mama. Yeah, those with a single parent and uh, okay. they're very strict. Oh, I know, I had a single parent mom too. <laughs> And yeah, she was like fucking home KGB. <laughs> I, I don't think he is. We'll see how my intuition works today. Go back to your place. All right. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm, I'm taking a closer look. Let's see. Oh, do you have a tiger on your arm? I've got two. <gasps> to me, it's obvious. I feel like <laughs> if you were to get like one tattoo of that animal, you're like, I like this animal. But if you get multiples, you're like, I really <laughs> like this animal. <laughs> how do you identify? Gay. Okay, cool. cool. Woman gay. Cool, me too. Yeah. Well, not yeah. woman gay, but yeah. gay. I know what you're yeah. Okay. What about like your ethnicity or your race? I am half black, half white. Okay, I'm gonna guess non furry. Why? Well, because one of the first things that's <laughs> I feel yes. like non black people are furry. Yeah. Hi. Hi. I'm taking a look at you. Now, I notice you have like very like sharp nails. Harvard, do some women have sharp nails to be like claws if they're furry? Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah. That. How often do you go out? Honestly, not often. Before I had a cat, I would frequent a cat cafe. Did you go to cat cafe just to meet the cats or the people? <laughs> or both? J mostly the cats. What do you do online? <laughs> <laughs> I know, I mean, just like scrolling stuff like Instagram, TikTok, that kind of thing. Porn? Like, no. <laughs> no? Sometimes. Okay, why well, you yeah. say no? I, I told my mom about this video. Oh, <laughs> hey mom. Did you have a 
favorite like movie that you watched over and over again as a kid? Or maybe a TV show? When I was like in elementary, middle school age, I was very um, much like a My Little Pony girl. Yay! <laughs> <laughs> My gut saying non-furry or maybe someone you care about a lot is a furry and they're trying to indoctrinate you, but you're like, uh, I don't know. <laughs> you're furry. Okay. <laughs> in my ignorance, furries might be a little socially awkward. Okay. <laughs> ah! I'm sorry. You're asking me about my sex, like what was I supposed to say? I didn't mean to. Cause I would've said it. I would've been no. like, I look, I look at three some thugs, okay? Hi. Hi. Nice necklace. Thank you. Max. Jay. Jay, what do you do for a living? For a living, I work in an animal shelter. Please, here, take a <laughs> <laughs> Oh, come on. Furry. What's your favorite animal? I really like frogs. Mm, that's not furry, but it's, <laughs> it's the cousin of a furry. Are you introvert or extrovert? I'm an introvert. I like my alone time. You do? Yeah. Because he is so into himself, I don't think he is furry. <laughs> so what are we going to do about you? You only have one left. I know. I'm screwed. <laughs> <laughs> what, what do you do for work? Uh, I'm a teacher. I'm an art teacher. <gasps> an art teacher. Cool. So do you do art on your free time as well? I do, yeah. I did it a lot more when I think I was like in middle school, high school. Mm -hmm. um, I feel like a lot of my friendships were based around like doing art and like posting it on DeviantArt, which is an online community of artists. And then I think after DeviantArt, I moved to Tumblr. Can I be honest? Do you think that she's a furry? Yeah. No. Oh, okay. <laughs> Why not? Being on DeviantArt is usually a clear sign, but something about the way that you answered it. I feel like a lot of furries are like, oh, yeah, I was on DeviantArt. I know, trash. You are a furry by default because it's my last thing, yeah. yes. In terms of like sex yeah. and role play, okay. right? Have you ever like role played as an animal? Never, no. Never? No. Listen, I be horse playing like a horse. You do? <laughs> well, maybe you're a freak. <laughs> <laughs> so Harvester, you want to switch some around? Yes, please. Okay. Can I have you sure. and you at the end there? Can you two switch, please? All right. Raise your hand if Harbor got you right. Yay! Yeah. Ah! Wow. <laughs> I am fucked up. We're gonna have the people who are furries go and put on their outfits. Okay. <gasps> cool. <laughs> oh, this is so beautiful. Whoa! <laughs> She's the wee. Oh, they're all so beautiful. Hell yeah. Even the ones not in fursuit. <laughs> Yay! All right, come on up. So you guessed me right. Okay. <laughs> so my name Sasha is what I go by. What is the character? Uh, it's a wolf bear. Wolf bear. Mm -hmm. So is this how you would like enjoy to portray yourself? <laughs> so I used to have a fursuit of my original fursona. I didn't fit the body anymore, but I would like an another fursuit of my fursona. How did you get into this? So I've been in the fandom for well over 20 years. Um, I just started online meeting people. It's actually how I met my husband. Uh, we've been together for a little over 11 years now. Wow, congratulations for 11 years of um, furry love. That's beautiful. Wow. All right, I need to walk to you. If you cannot <laughs> see how you can function in this. You just kind of guess. How to really? Function. Yep. So you have a little... I see through the eye holes here, yeah. like through a mesh. What's your furry name? Uh, so the suit here goes by the name of Emmett, but my nickname I go by is Arabin. What animal are you? A hybrid of a red panda and dinosaur. So why a dinosaur mixed with a red panda? Uh, so the thing was, this uh, is a suit from a, uh, from a friend, mm -hmm. and I bought the suit for them because they fell in touch with the character in the Sona. That's great! And you fell in love with the character, I guess. Yeah. Come up. My furry name is Raiden. Like, um... Like the Mortal Kombat character. Okay. <laughs> Okay, that's what I know. What came to mind when I said, <laughs> I think the furry life is more so for non-black people. I thought the same thing too. I'm, I'm a pretty new furry myself, so okay. <laughs> look at me now. Look at me now. <laughs> Must be really, how much um, did you pay? For this one, yes. I paid 2,500, but I have another one that's worth 13K. 
<laughs> wow. Is anything about being a furry sexual? Not inherently. There is a sexual side to the fandom, of course, but I think that's a part of any fandom. Yes. You'll get cosplayers that are fucking in suit. Have you had sex in a suit yet? No, I, I would be too sweaty and hot, and I prefer mm. to see. <laughs> <laughs> so, I got you right or wrong. Oh, you did get me wrong. I did get you wrong, yeah. so I thought you were a furry. Yeah, I'm just very nervous when I answer questions. Oh. Yeah. It's okay, maybe you'll be a furry someday. <laughs> someday, maybe. <laughs> oh, can I ask why the Hammerhead shirt? And I saw it online, up for auction. She spoke to me. I was like, this is so cool. The only Hammerhead shark fursuit, and I want it. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Come on up, my furry friend. And what is your name? My in-suit name is Matrix. Matrix. Yes. Like this. Yes. Okay. 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 Matrix is one of my personas. This is who I want to be, I think. Like, he's very confident, mm -hmm. whereas my other persona is more me now. I sort of have that, too. My monkey, Christian, is like literally me, but then I have um, another character who's like a Cheshire cat, and they're they're sort of like who I want to embody someday. You know what, for some reason, like, this face matches the voice. Really, does it? Yeah, like, it's really real for me right that, now. That's good. I actually agree with I that, that's, that's interesting. interesting. Yeah, it's yeah. really good looking, actually. Character. Thank you, I actually made this one myself. I knew that people, some people can do it. <laughs> yeah. So, in order to be a furry, do you have to, like, have a suit for absolutely not at conventions i wouldn't even say the higher population of people who go are in fursuit if you don't have the body part is that a certain type of suit is there a name for that yes yeah. this what i have right here is considered a mini partial a mini partial that sounds like a hair weave for black people <laughs> <laughs> thank you jay yeah, thank you. <laughs> <All right. laughs> okay my friend hello how we missed you. A lot of furry hugs, know. sorry. I don't know. At this I point. think it would be weird to show up for the guess a furry video and then be offended if someone guessed I was a furry. <laughs> I don't know who's doing that. <laughs> Initially, with the, you know, deviant art, like, who, furry? It's sad to say, but a lot of furries um, want to be more confident in being a furry, but the stigma surrounding it makes them feel like they should be ashamed. Yeah. So, because I know if someone were to ask me, like, Oh, were you ever on DeviantArt? I'd be like, yeah, I mean, I More was on DeviantArt, but not, not really anymore. <laughs> but you you were very like, yeah, I'm on DeviantArt, it's okay. Like I said, I was an art teacher, mm -hmm. so like I have students who are furries, and that's something that they're very into. Wait, young kids can be furries? Absolutely, kids can be furries. If you think about Disney movies, like is Mickey Mouse not a furry? He's a mouse that stands up. Thank you for being nice to us. <laughs> that you shouldn't have to say that. <laughs> it's incredibly creative and cool, and I think a lot of the times when people like shy away from it or think it's weird, it's just like a fundamental misunderstanding. Thank you. Thank you. You learned a lot today, huh? Honestly, when Sasha came out with just the mask, I thought that that was more like a leather type of community. There's a lot of overlap between the two, though. That's the most surprising thing right there. There's a lot of overlap and there's plenty of black people. What's something you wish more people knew about furries? I don't think furry is ever going to be mainstream, but I just wish it wasn't seen as this weird thing that people need to be bullied about. Yay! That's a cut. <laughs> Hi, I'm Brooke. I'm supposed to stay behind the camera because I can't remember a line to save my life. We have two games right now. They're on the shelves at Target. What does Blaine do now? He goes, That was gross.